Welcome to another episode of Timmy Talks, the channel where we talk old school magic. And welcome to another mail day video. So I've got two pieces of mail in the post, and um, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna start with this one. They're they're small little mail days, but they're quite special. This is uh, a mail sent to me by David. Um, he enjoys the channel a lot, and he left I think a comment on one of my videos saying, "Hey, I have a really nice booster wrapper. Would you be interested?" I'm like, yeah, you know, sure, because I collect booster wrappers as well. And he actually just sent it to me. So that's very, very kind of you, David. Just going to have a look and share it with all the viewers here on the channel. There we go. So it is an Italian Legends booster. Let's get it out of the uh, top loader here. Ooh, it's in really nice condition. Have a look. So Legends is an expansion that also came out in the Italian language in Italy. And I'm quite thankful for that because a lot of Italian Legends are, they're expensive, but they're still a bit more affordable than their English counterparts. Look at that sticker still on here, original probably made in Belgium. And there we have the Wizards of the Coast logo. So yeah, this is definitely gonna be added to my booster collection. Thank you so much, David, for sending this over. I really, really appreciate it. Um, and then we have another mail day, and this is a mail day by one of my patrons, Andy. And yeah, Andy, he's really a lover of the game. And we had a little tournament on Timmy Talks. Maybe you saw the videos um, on the channel already. It was a four horseman popper tournament. So that basically means that you've got the four Horseman sets, right? That's um, Arabian Nights, Antiquities, uh, Legends, and the Dark. And uh, you can play uh, you can play those cards in your deck. And Pauper, of course, standing for commons. You can only play with common cards from those four sets. So we had a little tournament. It was a lot of fun. I have to say red was a really strong color in there. Uh, if you want, by the way, I'll, I'll have an info card popping up. And you can then check out the playlist if you're interested. And in, uh, in looking at the the games, yeah. open this up. Ooh, it looks like we've got a letter as well. Always happy with that. Let's take a look. 18th of July, 2022. Ooh, that's a while ago. Oh wow! wow, wow. So I'm gonna put the card here. Let's first just read the letter. Okay. Um, greetings from Headless Horseman. Everyone in our pod from the Four Horsemen Popper Tournament signed this card. It is our way of saying thank you for all that you do to organize tournaments for the Timmy Talks community. Each player in our pod received a copy like this. We have also sent a copy to Crouton Man as well. Sweet! We chose one of the most effective cards in Four Horsemen Popper card pool. In order to gather these signatures, the cards were shipped all over the US and into Canada. Thank you, Timmy and Crouton Man, for organizing these fun and unique old school events. Keep up the great work. And then we've got signatures from their group, Chris, Derek, Tom, Andy, and Michael. That is pretty sweet, man. So Andy's, Andy's called Steam Floggery on, uh, on Discord, by the way. That is so cool. And yeah, this was the MVP card, definitely. Man, that is nice. Thank you so much, man. I really, really appreciate it. It's all about the community, isn't it? It's all about having fun and uh, yeah, thinking about goofy tournaments, making making fun videos about the format and uh, yeah, fantastic. Thank you so much, Andy. And of course, thank you, David, for sending me these boost, this booster wrapper. Just a very, very short middle day today, but I still wanted to send uh, share these two envelopes with you guys. And um, thank you for watching another episode right here on Timmy Talks, and see you next time.
Just think it's a somber cuisine. 